Okay, hello YouTube. Uh, today I'm going to show you um, how you do this cold looking color correction in Sony Vegas and this more warm color correction. And you can do this in many different ways, but I'm going to show you one way. Um, so, first off, I was going to say you can do this in every video editing progr program like uh, After Effects or uh, Premiere Pro. Um, you just choose the let's see uh, color curves. You have RGB color curves in Premiere, and the same in uh, you go to the Effects tab and type uh, curves in After Effects, and you can find this one color curves. But I, but I'm going to show it in Sony Vegas Pro 10. Uh, first off, you go to uh, Video Effects bar and choose color curves drag this reset none on your clip uh, and this will come up uh, and you have red green and blue so first off I'm gonna show you the cold one and you take uh, the blue and punch it up a bit like this and then you take the green one and take this down and at last the red one like this oh that's too much and you have to play it around uh, yourself to find the way you like it but this is pretty good I think like that you see before and after for uh, and then you also can drag soft contrast you take this uh, heavy contrast on the clip and you see it's uh, too much so you drag this up all the way and then you play with this bar and it like this that's pretty good pretty good uh, and also you can uh, 800 maybe like that uh, like a film look or you can take like 900 if you yeah like this that's pretty nice I think and the second and uh, this is was the um, uh, cold look and if you want to save it this uh, color correction you just can type uh, the name here like uh, cold look for example and then just save it here save preset and then it will pop up here cold look you see I already already have one so I to remove it if you type like wrong here or something you just um, uh, just if I take this away I uh, just drag this on here and then delete preset and then if you go out and then on here you see it's gone yeah and then I'm going to show you this more warm look color question uh, so I'm just going to remove this yeah and I already have this black uh, bars here so uh, you do the same thing again, reset to none and uh, first off you take, I take the blue one and um, drag it up yeah like this maybe and then I take the green one take it down up here and then the red one as this in the same as the green Let's see maybe like this and the same thing here you can save uh, as a preset so it will pop it pop up here and I take this away and I already have one called softish and you see it's pretty much the same 
here and uh, yeah I have this great one too yeah yeah here it is um, and it's pretty nice I think and you can do the same thing here and uh, go to uh, soft contrast and uh, now choose the va warm uh, uh, something and uh, take uh, and drag down this one so this uh, uh, black things around will be disappear and take the um, choose the effects tab and do the same thing drag this up or whatever you like and uh, play with this like that yeah and this is the cold oops uh, I'm just going to take this on soft contrast yeah I have the both here uh, the cold one and a more warm look and you see if you have a lot of uh, effects and things on your clip it will lag it will lag you see and then you can double tap on your clip and then you press shift B oops once again shift B not V B and then it will pre-render and it not and it uh, will not lag when you play it in Sony Vegas and uh, yeah and now it's done and then if you play it no lag and then you can add like sound effects and things uh, but this was a little tip for you and then if you want to uh, render it I do like this I think and then you take file render as and um, I uh, I save to my desktop I'm Swedish so it says something else uh, I, I render it in uh, Windows Media video um, warm cold look oops and and uh, same thing here I have uh, already a preset HD and quality VBR and yeah you can see you can maybe stop the video if you want to copy my render settings and yeah earn best of course and then you click say uh, I have render loop ready and only so it only will render this so I click save and it will render so thank you for watch watching my video and I see you later guys bye